As more companies operate in digital transformation, the need for skilled technology executives increases. According to the U.S. Department of Labor, employment for IT managers is projected to expand by 12% between 2016 and 2026, generating over 44 new positions. Many of these professions will be in the financial, industrial, healthcare, and government sectors. Since these sectors must be able to preserve, store, and analyze massive quantities of data. So, in this video, we will understand who is an IT manager and what are the must of skills to become a successful IT manager. Before we get started, I would like to address the agenda for today's session. We will start our session by understanding who is an IT manager and what are their common roles and responsibilities. Next, we will understand the skills you'll need to become a successful IT manager. I hope the agenda was clear. Now, if you like this video, do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, to learn more about ITIL and its practices, check out Invensys Learning's ITIL certification training which is curated for both beginners and experienced professionals. All of the necessary information is given in the description box below. Without further ado, let us get started with our first topic, who an IT manager is. IT managers are responsible for organizing, planning, and directing the organization's computer-related operations. They assist in determining an organization's information technology needs and are responsible for creating computer systems to meet those demands. The tasks of an IT manager vary in scope. In certain instances, the entire focus is on computer networks. In other instances, the emphasis may be on managing telecommunications networks and other electronic business support systems. This was just a brief introduction to who an IT manager is. Now, let's understand what their common roles and responsibilities are. The primary responsibilities of an IT manager are the management and management of all computer systems inside an organization. They will maintain the efficient functioning of these services by checking their effectiveness and the security measures taken against any vulnerabilities in software programs used on a daily basis, therefore assuring the security of operations in every department. Some of the common roles and responsibilities of IT managers are Plan, organize, manage, and assess IT and digital information operations. Next, manage IT employees via recruiting, training, mentoring, explaining work requirements, and evaluating performance. Then, develop new network troubleshooting techniques that save downtime and maintenance expenses. Next, work closely with departmental managers to assess the network's maintenance and expansion requirements. Then, monitor evolving network technologies and provide quarterly technical updates to the executive team. Next, in the event of a crisis, the individual is responsible for creating and implementing disaster plans that will keep the organization operational. Then, determine the reasoning and procedures for updating enterprise network software applications whenever a new version is published. These were some of the common roles and responsibilities of IT managers. Now, let's move on to our main topic and understand the skills required to become a skilled IT manager. IT managers play a crucial role in ensuring that the organization's IT systems support its objectives and support reinvention and change. IT managers must have great technical skills, but they must also exhibit a variety of other equally important skills and qualities such as First, communication and interpersonal skills. There are several reasons why IT administrators must possess exceptional communication skills. First, IT managers facilitate communication between IT professionals and the rest of the organization. IT managers must convey business needs to IT professionals and clarify critical IT requirements or issues to team members. They must be able to successfully communicate orally and in writing, as well as be skilled listeners. These skills will allow them to make successful presentations to senior management or key decision makers, generate relevant and up-to-date technical or business documentation, explain the latest cybersecurity rules to the organization's hierarchy, and negotiate with suppliers to get the best price possible on new technology purchases. It is also essential to communicate encouragement to staff employees, especially to recognize great performance. In addition, they should engage in social interaction with their teams, comprehend their issues, mentor and assist them in their professional growth, and be prepared to give training as necessary. Additionally, IT managers must be able to handle concerns without becoming defensive or, worse, offensive. Even if they do not have direct subordinates, IT managers should be able to develop productive teams. In addition, they should be capable of resolving and minimizing disputes, motivating personnel, and communicating with senior management about crucial IT problems or choices. Second is, problem-solving and decision-making. 
In the majority of organizations, today's IT systems play a more strategic role, bringing substantial value to the company. In order for this to occur, the systems must function properly and ensure business continuity, two areas for which IT managers are responsible and in which problem-solving and decision-making skills are essential. Even with the best IT infrastructure and personnel, problems are inevitable. An IT manager's responsibilities include quickly gaining control of problems, identifying their root causes, and implementing appropriate solutions. Delays in resolving a problem can be fatal to the business continuity and longevity of an organization. Therefore, IT managers must be able to tackle problems quickly and effectively. They should be familiar with their organization's IT infrastructure and technology ecosystem in order to identify perceived flaws and help in the design of better solutions to meet business requirements. Also, they should also support and contribute to a knowledge base of lessons learned that will facilitate future problem identification and resolution. IT managers must have strong decision-making skills in order to evaluate new technologies and assets and determine which ones the organization should invest. They may also interact with multiple vendors whose services, terms, and support must be analyzed and compared prior to making a final decision. Before making a decision, they must regularly analyze a particular situation and consider the current risks and future consequences. This is particularly important for critical change control or break or fix situations, as well as decisions that may have long-term or financial implications for the organization. IT managers must also make personnel decisions regarding hiring, promotions, terminations, and other team-related matters. Third, organization and time management. Typically, IT managers will have multiple time demands, necessitating effective organizational and time management skills to fulfill their responsibilities. If they manage many teams, they may also be asked to juggle multiple projects or teams, making simplification and the creation of an efficient workflow necessary. Organization and time management go hand in hand. IT managers must be aware of the duration of a project in order to schedule their days and select particular deliverables. They should also be adept at delegating, especially when time constraints are difficult. It is also essential that they manage their personal time, such as breaks and vacations, to ensure that they spend their time effectively, control their stress levels, and avoid burnout. IT managers should properly organize their team's time to ensure that activities are performed in accordance with the organization's service level agreements and key performance metrics since team management is part of their job description. In addition to guaranteeing team efficiency and productivity, managers should also ensure that team members' stress levels are controllable and their mental health is not compromised in order to reduce employee turnover. Fourth skill is business skills. Every IT manager is an important member of the corporation. Thus they must possess exceptional strategic thinking, financial management, and project management abilities. With these skills, they may assist senior management in comprehending IT infrastructure planning and budgeting, resource planning, policy formulation and execution, and digital transformation. Strong negotiating skills are a crucial advantage for IT project managers when dealing with suppliers, guaranteeing that they get the best bargains with the maximum possibility of success. Experienced IT managers have both a broad perspective and a keen eye for detail. Together, these often conflicting characteristics allow them to employ the appropriate technology to assist the organization in accomplishing its business objectives. These abilities also enable them to foresee future technological demands, allowing them to rapidly and inexpensively find the appropriate assets or resources to satisfy those needs. Change management is another crucial business skill that IT managers should know and improve. Following modifications to the IT infrastructure, they should be able to develop a change management approach that limits risk and reduces downtime. Fifth skill is self-development skills. In a rapidly changing industry where new trends and technologies emerge at a quick rate, it is necessary for IT managers to have a mindset centered on learning. They must keep up with the newest advancements in the sector, as well as ensure their own abilities are adequate. In order to lead efforts to safeguard their organization's systems and data, they need also be informed of new and growing cybersecurity problems. IT managers should invest in professional development courses and certifications as required since they are a good method to gain new skills and enhance existing ones. Attending business conferences and meetings is another excellent approach to engage in continuing education and remain up to date on best practices and industry standards. I would like to conclude the session by saying, IT managers must be able to manage budgets and deadlines while collaborating with multiple groups of people inside and outside of the business. To work successfully, they need good project management abilities, whether they are managing their own projects or managing others' projects while still completing their own. As an effective IT manager, Interpersonal and technical abilities are equally essential. 
So, with this, we have come to the end of this video. I hope it was helpful. Comment your thoughts in the section below. Do subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell, never to miss an update from the Invensys Learning Channel. Also, to learn more about ITIL and its practices, check out Invensys Learning's ITIL certification training. All of the necessary information is given in the description box below. Thank you. Have a nice day.